Hey everybody, hope you guys are all doing safe. So the Mobile World Congress is underway in Barcelona right now and Huawei has already introduced a slew of products including this Huawei MateBook X Pro 2022. It is Huawei's newest edition in its flagship laptop line and there are some subtle improvements. You have a 14.2 inch 3.1K display and one of the biggest upgrades to a lot of people is that the selfie camera, the webcam, it's now no longer hidden in the keyboard. Instead, it's back up at the top bezel. So when you're doing video calls, the angle is a little bit more flattering. Otherwise, you have all the internal spec bump that you'd expect. The keyboard is still probably the best in the business right now. 1.5 millimeters key travel. Pretty decent sized trackpad. And you have a new six speaker system that sound pretty good. Hey, done! Last season, after that unexpected run to the playoffs, we had the momentum in the city. Now, I have not had time to really use this laptop thoroughly yet, so I will have a review later. But this video takes a look at this laptop, not by itself, but in its relation in the Huawei ecosystem. Because also at MWC, Huawei introduced the system called Super Device. It's a software concept that basically connects this laptop to all of Huawei's accessories, which several of which are here. So the Huawei MatePro Expo 2022 is designed to work with everything here. You have the Huawei MatePad 11, the Huawei P50 Pro, and the Huawei MateView. This is my favorite monitor. It's a 3x2 monitor. I use it to edit videos. And this is also a relatively new product that Huawei announced at MWC. It's a new laser printer from Huawei. So obviously the MateBook X Pro now is connected to the Huawei MateView via USB-C cable. But you can also connect wirelessly. I've unplugged it, so I just have to go into the control center. You see right here, super device. This is a new panel that you will now find across all Huawei's consumer devices, laptops, tablet, phones. So you tap on super device and you get this little map that shows you all the Huawei product around the Maple X Pro. You see the Maple X Pro is the center of the universe and you have these other products in its orbit. So if I drag the main view icon into the middle like this, it should initiate pairing and the main view should turn on and just connect wirelessly. So now I am connected wirelessly. Now obviously it's not as smooth as using a wire, but you know, sometimes you, your laptop cannot be right next to your monitor. Let's say I'm working at the couch and I can connect wirelessly like so. So once you're connected, you can now use the second screen as an extended display. This is like the most basic setup to be honest. It's super device is much more fun when you pair it with these two guys right here. So we'll get out of super display first. So you see, I just dragged MateView away and then now MateView disconnects. I'm gonna drag MatePad 11 to the MateBook X Pro to connect these two now. Okay, so now the MatePad 11 is connected to the MateBook X Pro. Now I have an extended display right here. This collaboration between two devices can do a little bit more. So if you jump into Huawei's PC manager, actually do multiple things. You can mirror your screen. You can extend your screen, which is what I have done right now. And you can also do collaborate, which allows you to drag and drop files. So this is pretty cool. So right now I've gone into collaborate mode. So now the tablet is back working as a standalone tablet, but then my mouse cursor from the PC carries over to the MatePad. And then if I go into the photo gallery in the MatePad, so this is the MatePad's own photo gallery, I can drag and drop files over to the PC. So now I dropped it over and I have I have this picture that I took on the MatePad's webcam over here. And that is not all. You can also view your tablet files. So now you can, you're basically using this as a hard drive. So let's say you have a PDF document that's only in this device. You can now access this on your PC. Let's go back into extend mode because there are more cool things you can do with extend mode. So when you're extending a screen connecting to a PC to a tablet, you usually think of the tablet as the second screen for the PC, but then Huawei allows you to interact with your PC software on the tablet too. So for example, let's open up a sketch pad right here. Now you can draw your finger on a PC screen, but it's a little bit tough to do on a laptop, right? So just drag this window over here to the main pad. And now I can use the M pencil to sketch on this. Now it's much better, right? Because I actually have a proper stylus. And then when I'm done, I can just bring it back over to the PC side and I will have that sketch on my PC. So this is a level of synergy between laptop and tablet that other brands may not have gotten there yet. And this is Huawei's vision. They want to base 
everything around the computer like this is the center of the universe and everything else works around it likewise if you're using a huawei device you can connect a huawei phone to your laptop now you can also use super device to connect as you can see here the huawei p50 pro is listed but i actually like this way better you can just tap it on the pad you see it picked it up now i just tap connect now i have my huawei p50 pro screen directly on the matebook x pro screen this is not a new feature it's been around for several years but it's still very useful a lot of times i'm working and i'm getting like whatsapp chats wechat messages and i don't have to respond on the phone i can respond directly here i can access phone apps directly by tapping onto the screen. You can also cycle through your phone interface with your finger on the computer screen. And you can also see the camera viewfinder too. So I can zoom all the way out to the street, but then you can see the viewfinder here. See what this guy's up to. Okay, he's wiping his, uh, his mouth. And you can also access the files that are inside your phone on the PC now. So same thing, you can use this as a hard drive. And finally, there's the Huawei printer. Now, unfortunately, I am completely out of paper, so I cannot show you the printing action, but um, this is a pretty seamless device. That same thing, you can connect to your laptop or your Maypad or your phone via that super device manager. Once you're connected, you can just select a file to print and then it will print out here. And then if you come look at here, you have a Huawei shirt pad. So that means even if you don't have a PC that's connected to the printer, let's say you just have a Huawei phone, you can just tap your phone on a printer like this to transfer whatever file you want to print to here. And that also means even if you have a friend over or let's say you're in an office, anyone with a Huawei device can print whatever files they need from their phone just by tapping on a printer. And it'll come out so so this is huawei super device in a nutshell it is a new interconnected ecosystem that connects all huawei's consumer products with the pc laptop computer whatever as the center of the universe so i have a lot more content coming up including a review of this matebook x pro 2022 and several other stuff that are being announced at mwc so if you're interested in keeping up to date with all the latest gadgets Please consider subscribing to my channel or follow me on Instagram at Ben's Gadget Reviews. That's it for now. Thanks for watching.